Yes, sir! What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. And check it out, man. What I'm going to help you guys do today is improve your jump shot. After patch three, um, I am noticing more, more uh, made jump shots. It feels like I'm more in control now. It feels like that if I'm missing, it's because of me. But I think what, what some people are having issues with uh, right now is just not knowing. I mean, you know, I just don't know. Like, they want to find a good release. Somebody asked about a good high arcing uh, shot release. And uh, right now I'm using number 27. That's what I'm using in this right here. One of the best shots in the game, man. It's so easy. And one thing I do like is that the the feeling from part when you're shooting in part and when you're shooting in uh, here, you know, it's it's about the same. So, you know, it's not um, it's not different. I'm shooting, I'm, I'm playing on Superstar, by the way. Uh, so you guys know that. And then uh, what was I going to do? Uh, I wanted to show you guys this right here. So check out my 2K card. Like I said, man, I know everybody's better than I am. I ain't got no problem with that. I mean, I already know this. I'm garbage at the game. That's why I chose sharpshooter. So I, all I have to do is shoot. I don't have to dribble. I don't have to drive. I don't have to do anything else. All I got to do is get open and shoot. And uh, I'm trash. I'm complete trash. I know y'all numbers is better than this. So I'm not even worried about that. But I shoot 60% from the field out there. And damn, there's 60% from three. And that's in the part. And in Pro-Am, I shoot uh, shoot almost 60% from the field. And damn, they're 50% from three. So there's not a lot of, you know, you know, leeway, uh, uh, not a lot of give and take. Like, I'm consistently garbage-ass player. I'm a consistently garbage-ass player. This is what I do. I, I All I do is just play the game. So, you know, like I said, I know everybody's shit is better than mine. I'm not even worried about that. But, um... I'm just trying to let you guys know that if I am this bad and I can shoot this well, or, you know, I mean, and it might be trash, like I said, uh, you know, then, hey, you can do the same thing. That's, that's, that's the point of my videos, other than, other than me being, um, me being funny here and there. So the best three releases that I would say, uh, use right now will be John Wall. You got to look at that one and find your tail in that one. You can use Ray Allen. Ray Allen is um is a real good one. You can let it go as soon as his feet leave the floor, or you can let it go as soon as the ball get above his head, depending on what you like to watch. And this is number 27, jump shot 27. As soon as the ball gets on his face, I let it go. And that's green damn near every time. Somebody asked how I get rid of the shot meter. I'm trying to answer some of the questions that I'm seeing in the comments. That's the purpose of this video. Uh, you go down here, you go to uh, options. You can do this in the park as well. You just go to shot meter and put it on feedback only. That's all I want is feedback. I think I left it on in the park. Uh, you know, for some reason, but um, uh, but I just I just forget to turn it off when we get into games. So uh, as far as shooting goes, man, it ain't nothing groundbreaking that I'm doing or that I'm gonna tell you in this video. Um, you all probably know everything that I'm about to say, but a uh, somebody might not know. And uh, if you know everything, the, the video is not for you, obviously. You know, this is not one of my comedic videos or what have you. I mean, I got one of those coming up later today, uh, but you know. Uh, but but you know if you're better than if you're better than I am, there's no point in you watching the video, right? So check it out. The first thing that you want to do is set your hot spots. You see right here, I step into this spot. This is one of my cold spots, right? Probably gonna break. Okay, I still hit it, but you know you got to go in the game. You got to take shots from everywhere. Take shots from everywhere in my career. Get it up over fifty percent. If you can get it to seventy percent, get it to seventy percent, and that'll be like a red hot spot. But um, once you do that you'll be able to shoot much better in the park. I thought that hot spots didn't matter, and then I went into the game and set my hot spots, man. And once I did that, I was hitting at a, at a at a much higher percentage. I think a lot of people are suffering this year because they don't have badges, they don't play my career, they just don't do those things, man. So um, so you gotta go into my career. They're gonna force you to play my career this year. You're gonna have to do it, man. So go in there, at least set your hot spots, take a couple shots, get everything over 50%. Right here, you can tell, I can tell what my hot spots are because you know and this is live in the park too you see how that how that's red under me anytime that circle is red the outer circle or outer rim of that circle is red that's that's a hot spot i go up here to the top of the key ice cold because i don't shoot from the top of the key right i can still hit those shots but i don't shoot from the top of the key so i'm ice cold from there but anywhere inside of here cash uh that's 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 the first thing you want to do number two find a release that you are comfortable with man a lot of people keep changing their jump shots, think it's the jump shot. Listen, find something that you are comfortable with. If you're comfortable with 27 and you're just not hitting it, you just got to keep on shooting. And I know it's, it's difficult because you don't get as many uh, chances in the park to shoot 
as we as we think we should, but or you know you can't shoot it enough to get your um to get your uh to get you know get yourself in rhythm. But hey, something that's that's just a byproduct. Go play with some friends, um, uh, and you know just take smart shots, and 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 just get you know take practice taking smart shots, practice getting open, practice um. And then just practice your release. And that's the number three thing, man. You're going to have to practice. Like, I come in here, I'm in here like a, like for as bad as I am, just to get me to 60%, I have to come in here and shoot this basketball like an hour every day on whatever release I'm using. I come in here and shoot this thing like an hour every day, man. So I know the release would like, I, I, I can literally close my eyes and hit, you see that? I, I can close my eyes and hit this shot because Look at that. I closed my eyes and greened it just now because I know the shot that well. It's another thing that Mr. 2K was saying. Sometimes you got to do the timing just by popping your, uh, like this. Like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can get your timing like that as well. You might have to tap your foot. You might have to blink your eyes or something. But, uh, I can, my timing, um, it's just, it's just, it's just an internal timing. I really don't even have to look at the shot. So, that's where you want to get to, where you can almost make these shots with your eyes closed. Because, I mean, that's that's really what you want. You want to take everything out of the equation. It's really just timing at the end of the day. Anybody can get good at this part of the game. But you're going to have to take smart shots, man. But like I said, just work on your time. You got to work on the shooting, man. Every time they change the pass, they're going to have to work on shooting. As far as past three goals, I have been able to hit shots. Um, I just wish they would stop changing the game. Like, look, put it one way. Let people adapt. If there, if we really need a change, then of course, of course, we should change it. But you know, the way that it is, man, there's, there's nothing wrong with it right now. I played this morning. I have noticed that post scores and inside scores can't be fucking stopped now because I done got fucking murdered by two of them in the last 24 hours. I mean, they just go down there and just press A and slashes. Oh my God, they go down there and press X now with that damn relentless, relentless finish of Hall of Fame. They making it. That's all they got to do. So we're back to that from last year, uh, you know, with this new patch three. So, I mean, I'm not mad at that because I'm telling you, when I'm telling you, I, I think his name was uh, Chisholm, Chisholm something. Yo, that dude fucking murdered me twice. I couldn't do shit. My man was standing there like this with his hands up and everything. Couldn't fucking stop him, dog. Like, it is what it is. But it really just depends on, like I said, I don't expect to be able to stop, you know, really anybody um, down low because I am a small forward. He was a power forward and, uh, now, obviously, he's going to be stronger than me and have, like, massive inside scoring. So, it wasn't shit I could do about it, man. But, I mean, I swear, every center that I've defended in the last 24 hours, they can just press X. Get in the paint, press X. And uh, you ain't stopping this shit. So, hey, it is what it is, man. You got to take your lumps if you're playing a small forward or whatever. Or, you know, if you end up playing a big man. But that's how I should be. Should be able to murder my ass. But, uh, you know, but, hey, I get my get back on the outside. I just have to green these shots, man. But like I said, man, try this release right here. See how it works out for you. I know everybody's better than I am, and I'm the last person that should be giving out tips about this game. But trust me, there's somebody that can benefit from what I'm telling them, man. So the three best jump shots in the game uh, that I'm using right now, uh, number 27 is, is the best for me, John Wall and, uh, and Ray Allen. And like I said, with this, with this number 27, man, you can either let it go when he clicks his heels like that, or you can let it go right when he gets it above his face. I mean, and it's going in. It's a nice high arcing shot. And uh, I mean, once you get the timing down, you're not gonna miss, man. And you're gonna miss wide open shots. It's gonna happen. I had two that, I, that were on the line that I just, I smoked both of them. I mean, it just was what it was. And sometimes we have to admit that it's our damn fault too that we miss shots too. So, you know, it is what it is, man. Like I said, that's a bad one right now. I just missed the motherfucker. But like I said, you just, you just gonna have to come in here and practice, man. And just adapt to that lag and just do what you got to do, man. But like I said, this probably was a pointless video for most people. But I hope it helps somebody. If it helped you out, let me know down in the comments. Say, yeah, it, it really helped. But like I said, I'm the last person that should be giving out uh, advice because I shoot only 60%. But anyway, man, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I, I just want to try to give you guys a hand, man. And, uh, and hope, you, hope you guys enjoyed the video and, and hope this helps somebody out. I'll be looking for some more jump shots that got easy tails that you might be able to use. But, uh... Just try number 27, John Wall, or try um, or try uh, Ray Allen, man. See how those work out for you. If you, if, if one of those don't work out for you, um, I don't know what to tell you. 
And also, we should hit 45,000 today, man, so we might be doing a little giveaway or something like that. I got these uh, jerseys. I got an Odell Beckham Jr. jersey and a KD jersey, man. Y'all let me know if y'all would like something like that, man. And uh, I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! I can't leave on a miss, man. Cash! Pipe it up, I got the pipes on reserve. ATL, y'all know what to do, baby! Rise up, Falcons rise up!